managing thruster faults on your Deep Trekker ROV. At some point during ROV operations, you will experience an obstructed propeller. Seaweed and plastic garbage are most likely to cause obstructions. The magnetic coupling mechanism will allow the brushless motor to slip, preventing damage. If speed gain is set high enough, the ROV will recognize a current draw going beyond a safe threshold and the ROV will disable this thruster automatically. In this state, the ROV will redistribute thrust to allow you to continue operations with one less thruster. Depth fold mode and vertical stabilization will be disabled if a vertical thruster is obstructed. If more than one thruster becomes obstructed, maneuverability may be severely compromised. When any ROV fault occurs, a pop-up message will appear in the top left-hand corner of the screen naming the fault. Pressing Enter will automatically navigate to the fault menu, while pressing Function and Enter will automatically clear the fault, re-enabling the thruster. Tell the ROV to re-enable all faulted thrusters by clearing all faults. Turn your speed gain up and thrust back and forth to try to clear the obstruction. If this results in another thruster fault, you will need to pilot back to your deployment point and physically clear the thruster. Clear faults in the fault menu and redeploy to continue your mission.